they were asking us to evaluate a formula. So here is your formula. Okay, it's actually the perimeter, perimeter of a triangle, and you add up all three sides. Now it tells us the perimeter, the P, it tells us the side A, and it tells us the B. It does not tell us the C. So we need to plug in and then solve for C. And usually when you see evaluate, that means plug in. Let me put that here. Plug it in. So we do know what P is. Every time I plug in, I use a blank set of parentheses for an open space of the thing that I want to plug in. Okay, that way if you're plugging in a negative number, you're not going to make any sign errors. So P is 28. A is 8. B is 10. Okay, and now I have everything in there except for C, and I'm going to solve for C. So at the next step, I see that I can do 8 plus 10. That will give me 18 plus C. Okay, and solve for C. Get this grumpy old C all by herself. We need to get rid of an 18, which is being added. So we need to subtract 18 from both sides. Minus 18 from the right side of the equal sign. Minus 18 from the left side of the equal sign. 28 minus 18 is 10 equals... 18 minus 18 is 0. And there's my answer. 10 equals C, which is the same thing as C equals 